What is up guys Vespucci HD here so today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a fresh new plate on the car that we duplicated from the video that I just uploaded. So what you're going to want to do is put the vehicle that we just duplicated into your MLC that's inside the personal vehicle storage. So that's pretty much all we're going to need and once you go in there go into your vehicle and this really doesn't require any kind of timing it's really fast and easy. So, what you're going to want to do is get inside your car that you duplicated. Open up your phone and as the exact same thing how we did in the other video. When you're about to go into the internet icon, press the gas button. So, I messed up there, but try again. I did that way too early, so like I pressed it at the exact same time. So, wait a bit a little bit more all right so when i'm about to press it i'm just gonna hold r2 so like right here and then what you're gonna want to do is go to southern San Andreas. you can either buy an lg rha or get any of these free cars but if it doesn't work for you switch to another car and what you're gonna want to do the one i'm using because it works better with is the fagio but it works with all of them but if it doesn't happen to work for you with other vehicle besides the Fagio just switch to the Fagio or any other vehicle free vehicle alright so you're just gonna want to keep on holding the R2 button or the gas button the entire time so you're just gonna want to go to buy it and go to the mobile operation center and just go right here and just purchase it accept this screen right here and press circle triangle and keep on holding R2 alright so once you come right here, you should notice that it's a different plate. Uh, before I started this video, or if you saw my other video, my all of my plate numbers were 44, the first two digits. So that's pretty much it's pretty much that fast. And what you're gonna want to do is just wait until the Fagio or which uh, any vehicle that you guys ordered or bought, you're just gonna want to wait for it to get delivered. So I'm going to go ahead and wait, but I'm going to skip it for you guys just to save you guys some time. Alright, so once the vehicle does get delivered in, I'm just going to go ahead and wait for the little icon on the bottom left to go away. And then I'm going to go into the MLC. Show the play one more time. So nine. Alright, so just go into your MLC once that little icon has gone away. And that's pretty much it that's how that's just just really fast to do this so every time you duplicate a car you're just gonna want to go ahead and do this I'm gonna show you guys the car I also did it on my other one because I duplicated two if you guys saw my other video there was two LG retros I'm gonna show you guys right now Alright, so the original's right here. This one's the original. This is the car dupe. And I'm gonna show you guys right now. So this is the original one that I duplicated. I'm gonna show you guys the license plate number. Alright, the first two digits are 44. And this is another car that I duplicated before I started the video on how to duplicate and I changed the license plate number to 60 there the first two digits and then this one's the one right here now as you guys can see it's 09 so both of these cars right here the two that I dup duplicated right here they both had the same license plate number as the original one so this is a method on how to duplicate your cars without custom plates because the glitch that I showed you guys on duplicating the cars it's way faster to do it with a custom plate but this is way how to do it without custom plates but keep in mind you guys if you guys uh request the Fagio and your car goes away and it just disappears then you guys are gonna want to quickly close the application sorry I forgot to mention that at the beginning of the video or when I was at that part but yeah that happened to me once so just close the application as soon as that happens and load back up into GT5 go to your MLC and you guys should notice that the LG retro is still there alright guys so 
I'm gonna show this one more time on how to do this because I didn't show one important part or I didn't talk about it on what to do so I'm also gonna just show this again if you guys didn't get the first time so I went ahead and duplicated another vehicle and the license plate is 09 so I'm going to my personal vehicle storage the originals inside there but go ahead and replace it so the original is gonna be back in my garage where this one was in so once again go into your LG retro or the car that we're duplicating open up your phone and as soon as you press the internet just hold the gas button alright so go down to southern San Andreas go to whichever vehicle that we're gonna be using once again you could use any of these free vehicles right here or the LG RHA but I'm personally gonna use the Fagio because I think it works the best and if it doesn't work for you once again just use a different vehicle like say if the Fagio doesn't work for you use the LG RHA or if the LG RHA doesn't work use the Burger Shot or one of those vi uh, vehicles and alright so what you're gonna want to do is just go ahead and buy the vehicle that we're gonna be using the Fagio and go down to the mobile operation center and keep on holding the R2 button or the gas button the entire time so you're gonna wanna go ahead and replace the vehicle that's inside the MLC accept this alert screen right here and press circle on this and triangle and keep in mind you're gonna have to keep on holding the gas button the entire time alright so that part where I was just talking about when the Fagio like once you purchase it and you replace your LG RHA I mean your LG Retro or whichever vehicle that you're duplicating and you notice that you're not in your vehicle no more you just go into your uh, personal vehicle storage and there's no vehicle in there as soon as that happens you're just gonna wanna close the application as soon as possible as soon as that happens cause you will lose your vehicle if you guys don't do it and once you guys close the application load back up GT5 and go onto online request your MLC and go back into the personal vehicle storage and you should notice that your LG retro is still in there or whichever vehicle that we duplicated so I'm going to show you guys the license plate changed it was 09 but now it's 88 so you're just gonna want to wait for the Fagio or whichever vehicle that we bought to be delivered so at the bottom left it will show so I'm gonna go ahead and skip it to when it does show